someone I know here in Bali just had a motorbike accident and had to pay like 10 to 20 K US dollars for surgery because they broke their leg uh, because the travel insurance wouldn't pay for it because he didn't have an international driver's license. So real quick, as you guys know, motorbike accidents, you know, not only in Southeast Asia, anywhere they can happen. So how to get your travel insurance to actually cover the expenses. Number one, you have to have travel insurance. Okay, obviously. Number two, you actually have to have an international driver's permit. Links below for how to get that. Number three, you have to be wearing a helmet, of course. Number four, the bike can't be more than 150 cc's. So most standard travel insurance doesn't cover big bikes over 150 cc's. Uh, number five, of course, you have to be abiding by all traffic laws. So if you're speeding, if you're doing a wheelie, if you're breaking the traffic law, like going through red light or a stop sign or something, then travel insurance will get you on the technical details and they won't cover it. So anyways, there's that quick tips that you should do before visiting Bali or Southeast Asia or anywhere. Get your travel insurance, link below for the one that was recommended to me and the one that I have. Also, how to get your international driver's license. Better safe than sorry. All right, there's my quick tip of the day. See you guys in Bali.